All right, it's Joe Bruin here with AllAccessEntertainment.com. It's Rhode Island Comic Con 2019, and one of the biggest stars here, he's the hardcore legend, oh. Mick Foley. It's okay, I thought you were about talking about Kurt Angle or oh. <laughs> Dave Batista. Mick, thank you so much for joining us today. It's nice to be here. Now, what's it like meeting your fans up close and personal at events like this? I love it. I really do enjoy it. Uh, Fridays and Sundays are the mellower days. Don't get me wrong. All things being equal, I'd love to be rocking the whole time. But if you can't be rocking, you would get a chance to uh, meet people, hang out. I mean, it was at a convention like three years ago that I met Nita Strauss, the great guitarist. And if uh, they, the weekend had been rocking, that uh, meeting and friendship would have never taken place. So I, I do. I like it a lot. Awesome. Now, events like this, you see collectibles, you see people exploring their hobbies and creating new ones. As a child, what were you collecting? What was your big... Oh, wow. Yeah, I had a coin collection, a stamp collection when I got to be like 10 or 11, a beer can collection. Uh, so uh, we would collect beers, beer cans from whenever uh, the family traveled. I had about 150 of them. I think I'm going to donate them to Foley's uh, Sports Bar in New York City because uh, it doesn't do me any good. Right. And then uh, comic book collecting as well. I had a, like a, almost an uninterrupted streak of like 110 Incredible Hulks. There's a oh, couple wow. missing, but it's almost uninterrupted. Awesome. Now we're attached here to the Dunkin' Donuts Center, part of the event taking place there as well. Do you have any memories from the Dunkin' Donuts Center? Oh yeah, yeah, my second match ever. Was, uh, we called it the Providence Civic Center. I won't call it the corporate name. Like I won't go to Louisville and say the words, take me to the Yum Yum, yum Center. Yeah. I won't do it. It's the Louisville Garden. So the Providence Civic Center, yeah, I had my jaw dislocated by the Dynamite Kid, didn't yeah. chew solid food for a few weeks. That was my second match ever. Oh my gosh. Now, Providence Civic Center, there's so many big arenas out there. Worcester, where you won the championship for the very first time. Boston, MSG. Do you have a favorite out there throughout your career? Yeah, I think uh, this is where I clumsily segue into my show in Saugus, Massachusetts uh -huh. on Sunday. The Kowloon is like, uh, it's become such a wrestling institution. Absolutely. And they have events upstairs, so I'm going to be doing my uh, nice day tour, bringing it to Saugus. Uh, it's a great place for so much wrestling history and some diehard fans uh, who will look forward hopefully to me bringing that book Have a Nice Day to Life on stage there, right there at the Kowloon and I'd like to say that tickets are uh, scarce but there are plenty of them and you can buy them at the door for a 7.30pm show on Sunday at the Kowloon. Alright, you heard it here Sunday, Kowloon, a staple in New England Mick Foley ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for taking the Have time. Have a nice day